are so unserious let's talk about it so there's this guy that i see all the time and we always talk in passing when we see each other i do not have this man's number we've never seen each other outside of where we always see each other but the other day he's like i need to talk to you i'm like okay cool pull me to the side he's like i really like you i'm interested in you i'm really feeling you but i just know i'm not ready for you My so mistake number one, you already are confessing to her how much you like her, how much you feel in her and all these different type of things. And yet you don't even know her, you know what I'm saying? And you know, the thing is as men, we're so used to coming from the mind frame of, man, she looks super good. She got some fat back there, man. Ooh, I wanna get inside of her. You thinking about all of that, but you're not even thinking about, man, can she even, does she even fit into my life? Is she somebody I want in my life? Coming from it from that angle, when you come from it from an abundance mindset, it's better because you're looking at what can you do for me instead of looking at her like, oh my God, you look so good. I'll die to have a chance with you. I've never, never went on any dates, never talked on the phone. He don't even have my number. So the feeling is not mutual. <laughs> so I'm listening. Also, you know, you gassing me up, so I'm all ears. You're just gas, like she said, just gassing her up for free. You know what I'm saying? She don't even know you. She spoke to you a couple times in passing, but yet you're spilling up all your feelings because of how she looked. She may have something fat back there and you turned on by that and you can't control your sexual energy. So it's all this, man, I'm really feeling you and I really like you and I really see a future with you. And she just eating it all up. But I'm just like, okay, thank you, thank you. So I finished doing what I'm doing and later when I'm about to leave, he comes and get me again and he like, so what do you think about what I said? And I'm like, you right. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, like you cool and shit. Like, I respect it. I like, bro, this is not kindergarten when you're writing the notes and saying, do you like me? Yes or no? Please circle by the end of the day. Again, man, you just really showing her how thirsty you are, that you got no direction, no patience. And when you gotta, you have to be patient around women. It can't be forceful. It has to be almost her idea. You know what I'm saying? You already messed up from the rip and you can't even see that because you're, you're projecting how you feel onto her. When in reality, you're not thinking with a logical mind because if you was thinking like me, I'm, I'm trying to see, is this a girl I would be interested in going out with? Is this a girl I could see myself being around? When you're coming from, again, when you're coming from an abundance mindset, you're not coming from scarcity. You're coming from a place of what can this person do for me? Is it, would this person be a good fit into my life? You know what I'm saying? Because you're making it seem like so easy to get into your life. So she doesn't see no benefit to I don't know what to say. Like, I don't feel the same way about you. I, the way that I talk to you and greet you, and I, that's how I talk to everybody. I'm just a friendly person. I'm very social, but trust me, when I like somebody, they know I like them. So I'm like, uh and again, that's something I say to you guys all the time. When a woman likes you, she's gonna make it very, apparent she's gonna make it very clear that she wants to get with you you know what i'm saying versus a woman who doesn't like you is gonna give you the run around she's gonna make it difficult for you but again this man is coming from the wrong mind frame you're coming from a sense of you, you seen something fat back there and now you you want to smash so that's the mind frame that you coming from your little head is taking over your big head i respect it and i think that it's very commendable for you to come up to she doesn't respect it to me and for you to even like recognize that that's what i say i guess i could have just said i don't like you but either way that's not the point the point is i get on instagram a few days later and this man has a whole fucking girl i almost fell this man has a whole girlfriend a girlfriend that he's been dating for a long time and again, I'm not interested in him, so I'm not even tripping that you're off the market. I could care less. It's just. So dude, you have a whole girlfriend. Why are you in a relationship with somebody that I'm sure y'all talked about being exclusive? Why are you in a relationship if you don't want to be in a relationship with her? Oh, because you don't trust yourself. Because you ain't got standards for yourself. You know, at the end of the day, lying about different things like that, that's not gonna get you nowhere. It's not gonna get you nowhere. It's gonna get you, women do not respect liars. You are trying to lie and maneuver your way around the game and she didn't discover your real life and you tell her that you like her and all these different type of things. Again, all of this is you're coming from a scarcity mindset. You're coming from a place of lack. 
you coming from a place of I'm desperate, I need a meal. And again, at the end of the day, when a woman likes you, you don't have to do any of this. You're trying to prove yourself to her when in reality, you should be seeing how she can be a benefit to your life. But you're so caught up in the looks. You know what I'm saying? Someone needs to share that in my last video with them. You got to learn how to get past the looks. If you can't get past a woman's looks, you're going to suffer because she controls you. If you let what's down there control you, you know what I'm saying? It's over with. So what I would say to Buddy is, man, you need to, to, to rethink about your life and your direction because you clearly are worried about the wrong things. And then my message to everybody else is, man, don't sugarcoat nothing, man. Like, be honest. Like, if you see a woman that you, you like and you think she may be interesting, go up and talk to her for a little bit and invite her to come have a coffee or a smoothie with you. You know what I'm saying? Then go from there. You know what I'm saying? But pay attention to how she's acting. Pay attention to if she's asking you questions. Pay attention to how her, what, her, what is her body language saying. You can't do that if you're so wrapped around you want to get inside. You know, you know what I'm saying? You want to get inside of her. You can't even comprehend what's really going on because you're so caught up in her looks. So that will be my message to dudes at the end of the day, man. Have some standard for yourself. Be honest and be straight up, man. All right, guys, that's my video for today, man. I appreciate you guys for kind of coming over to the channel as always. And make sure you continue to comment, like, and subscribe to the channel. And I'm gone.